how bad do things need to get before you'll take action? Now, I know that might sound a bit silly, but here's the thing. So many people do not take action when stress or anxiety increases. They leave it for quite some time until the stress is maybe like an eight or a nine and then they reach out in complete despair because they've hit that tipping point, right? And then when we hit that tipping point, it's not just the event that's happened that we need to deal with, it's all the unprocessed emotions. Because the stress, the tipping point has been reached because of all the unprocessed emotions. And so many people leave it until they hit that tipping point before reaching out. They leave the, they leave it until they're maybe about to lose their job. They're about to close their business. They're about to lose their marriage. They've lost their relationship. They're losing friendships. Family relationships are breaking down. So people will leave their life spiraling out of control until it reaches this big tipping point. And why, why do we do that? We seem to think that it's so much more courageous to be carrying lots and lots of stress than it is to actually speak about our stress. It's more courageous to speak and it's easier to speak than you think. The first hurdle, that first decision of reaching out for help is the hardest, but see when you've done that, it gets easier. It gets so much easier and I always 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 have clients who say i wish i had done this sooner i'm so regretting not reaching out when it was hitting a four or a five or a six when i seen the stress the anxiety starting to increase i wish i had reached out then i've left it until now and now i've got a lot more to deal with how bad does it need to get before you reach out for support Ask yourself that question today. I'm here, I'm around. If you want to chat, try catch up. It's much more courageous to talk about your stress than it is to carry it every single day because it will just ruin and infect all areas of your life. I'm here. Let's have a very thoughtful Tuesday.